What's going on guys? So in today's video, I want to show you something that I experienced. As I installed this shift box into this Integra, I was trying to install the cables onto the box itself and I noticed something. It happens to be missing the bushing. So I was supposed to like, great, no bushing. How the heck can I put this on? So I'm going crazy looking through all kind of plastics and stuff like that or bushings that I have, anything that would fit. And then I run into this, a pen. And I'm like, huh, I wonder if I take this pen apart, would this work? So I tried this, happens to be a little too small. Then I grabbed this end of the pen and I'm just like, I wonder if this would fit in here. And look at that, it just happens to fit perfect. So I'm like, all right, let's try to see if it fits in here. And what are the odds? It happens to fit perfect in there too. And now I'll be able to make the perfect size bushing with a pen. So now I'm gonna cut a piece of the pen off to fit in there as a bushing. And just like that, I'll have a bushing for the cable. And voila, factory shift cables uh, repaired just that simple with a pen that I had at home. That's pretty, pretty cool. Figured I'd share that with you guys. So let me know what you think. As you can see here, I grabbed the Dremel and started cutting the pen to where I think it's gonna be the proper size visually. Therefore, I have to cut it and trim all the excess off and make it as straight as possible. Also, I gotta kinda clean up the burrs from the Dremel cutting wheel itself. You can see how I've made all these sharp edges onto the plastic, so I gotta clean all this stuff up. Maybe grab a pick and peel up all the inside and stuff like that and just clean this thing up so it could fit into the shifter itself and go try it on from here. Let's see it on, if it works. So let's test fit it now that I cut it. See if we could put it in here, see how it fits. Put it in the shifter itself. Let's slide the bolt through it. And it seems like it's going to work. So that's pretty neat that we were able to save this thing. All right, now that we got it all nice and tight, let's test it out. See how this new um, pen bushing works. Well, can't go in first with a lockout on, so let's deactivate that. That's the one, two lockout. And then back here, we got the five, six lockout. So let's go into first gear, second gear, third gear, fourth gear, fifth gear, reverse. Everything seems to work perfect. Gotta get this little trim to hold down. Uh, do something about that next but basically how to cut a portion out of the trim for the shift box to work and all that because I didn't like the way it looked without the entire trim you can see way too much of it so I like it like this it looks a little cleaner I just got to trim this back portion a little bit here that way it stops trying to lift it up but there you have it now you know how to fix your shift cables if the bushing ever goes out or you lose it